chief of the architects. When my eldest son was about three years old, he came home from nursery school, having learnt about the jobs that mummies and daddies did. He'd heard about train drivers, doctors, um, sh shopkeepers and, and teachers. And so he asked me when I came home what my job was. Without thinking, I replied, chief architect. He ran around the room excitedly, proclaiming I was chief of the architects. Those extra two little words seemed at the time endearing and, and, and funny. Later on, I realised there was real wisdom in that statement. I may have been the chief architect in the title, but I definitely wasn't the biggest or strongest architect, just the lead of the team. It's a habit we develop. It's too easy to assume we need to be the most knowledgeable or to be the authority on every single architectural subject. Accountability may rest with us, but the captain of a sports team doesn't have to be the best player in all positions. Acknowledging this, I believe, leads to the best architectural team-built solutions.